Hello, welcome to Ferry's Kitchen. Uh, tonight's recipe is a creamy bacon and pea fettuccine dish. Um, so I'll just quickly show you the ingredients and show you how to get it all going. Alright, the ingredients we need. Uh, roughly 350 to 400 grams of uh, fettuccine. One cup of uh, frozen peas. Uh, roughly a third of a cup of uh, good olive oil about six rinds of uh, bacon that I've just chopped up nice and fine 200 grams of button mushrooms that I've just sliced finely 200 grams of Swiss brown mushrooms that I've sliced finely um, 300 ml just one of these tubs of uh, I've got light cream you can use full full fat cream if you like um, three three eggs that I've lightly beat, beaten two tablespoons of uh, basil that I've just torn apart with my hands and about, I've got a large cup of uh, parmesan cheese, but you can cut that back if you like. So uh, let's get cooking. Right, once the water's boiling, it's time to uh, get the pasta going. Let's pop that in. And while that's going, we'll get the actual sauce ready. I've just got that on a medium heat. I'll just put in a little bit of oil, not too much, because it is bacon after all. Pop all the bacon in. And we just want to cook the bacon until it starts to get a little bit of colour, which will take three or four minutes. So I'll just keep doing that and I'll be back in a minute. Okay, once we've uh, cooked the bacon, we'll just add the rest of the oil. Pop all the mushroom in. And we'll just sweat that down for a few minutes. Okay. I'll, just, I'll be back shortly. Okay, while the uh, mushrooms are sweating down, we'll just add the frozen peas to the pasta and just cook them quickly for about a minute or two. Give them a quick stir. There we go. Add the bacon back to the mushrooms. Okay, the bush, mushroom and bacon mix is uh, that's finished. So we'll just turn that off, and they can sit there and stay warm. And this is now ready. So I'll just quickly drain this, and I'll be back. Okay, we have the pasta mix there. We'll just add the mushrooms and the bacon. We'll add the cream. The egg. The cheese. And the basil. We'll just give that a mix through. I'll just turn the heat off while we're doing this so it doesn't keep cooking on the base. Don't need probably any more salt because of the bacon, but uh, give it a good crack of pepper. And that's it finished and ready to serve.
there we go, there's a the finished product. Um, creamy bacon and pea uh, fettuccine uh, with a fair bit of cheese in it. Um, you can cut back the cheese if, if you really want to. But yeah, quick and easy and fantastic. Hope you enjoy.